Mm-hmm. We're purely looking at it and making an observation that during the archery season, we've seen a lot more crossbow hunters specifically uh, yeah. on, on public land. And so, and at the same time, we're not saying, hey, there should be less crossbow hunters. Not at all. Mm-hmm. Um, it just seems like, and, and that's one specific example. It seems like t- to maintain the quality of that experience, not as it relates to the animals, but as it relates to the human interaction, right. that it may make sense to have special considerations for a different weapon class, you know, such as crossbows or, or use any weapon in that. And so the, the result that I'd be looking for there would be, um, ultimately you guys have a goal for the amount of animals that should be harvested, the amount of people that should be on different pieces of land at a certain point during the season. It seems unbalanced at this point towards the archery season. And the most recent change on that has been the introduction of crossbows into that season. Hmm. Yeah, it's an interesting discussion. Be look, look, it's good. It, I could just see it now in the uh, the papers. Is well, yeah, if you have a separate <laughs> vertical bow and a separate uh, yeah. crossbow, that's the way you do it. Let's face it; that's what we're talking about. Yeah, you separate yeah. those two and have well, separate well, seasons. Or, or, or who gets Brian to e- go first? Yeah, sure, sure. And I'm I'm open to that. I, I guess, and I'm, I could be dead wrong, but so t- tell me how you guys are looking at this. You know, obviously there is a difference in the is lethality the right word to use there you know effectiveness effectiveness archery currently has a much longer season than firearm does right and and i assume it's because you can kill a lot more deer a lot faster and more effectively with and there's more licensed hunters with a rifle than you can at least in pennsylvania yeah and and 100 i won't accept an argument on this crossbows are will you know, is the same way c- c- compared to a vertical bow. You could kill more deer faster at a further distance with less experience than a crossbow. Hundred percent. Nothing against those people that are shooting on this for. point. Then, okay. Since we're sitting around the fire, let's look at data. So, what you yep. look at the proportion of vertical bow hunters to crossbow hunters, mm-hmm. they're taking about perpetually or proportionally the same number of deer. So, your crossbow hunters aren't taking more deer. Any, any size will mount than your vertical bow hunters, okay? Mm-hmm. Right. We'll is there the through. same number of them, though, Brian? Is there 50% bow hunters and 50%? It's pretty close. It's like 54 to 48 or something like that. It's pretty close. Okay. Oh. Now let's look at – so that's data. That tells yep. us that – That's new data to us. We're happy yeah, to hear it. that's good. That's what we want. That's yeah. what we want. For instance, a shorter crossbow season. So let, let's say if, if archery is whatever it is, 12, 12 weeks yep. or something like that, a gun is whatever, two weeks, mm-hmm. and you say crossbow is six weeks – you would effectively harvest the same number of animals. Does that seem accurate? Well, the question comes is like for crossbows, if you add a Sunday, do you harvest more deer because of crossbows right. or vertical bows? Mm-hmm. Right. What we're, we looked at data in other states and what we found is it just spreads out mm-hmm. when the harvest is taken. Maybe right. there's a few more, but you got to remember in the big scheme of things, a few more doesn't really Well, and it, that could be a weather factor too throughout that season. You know, if you have a, a, a Saturday, Sunday that gets washed out, you're probably going to kill less well, deer. And what I'm suggesting is the opposite. By reducing the length of the crossbow season, essentially the same number of deer would get harvested. And that's the goal. And since but since that is would that, that put all, more pressure though during those six weeks because you're jamming them into a tighter time frame no it's just going to reduce the amount it's going to reduce the overlap with a longer archery season mm-hmm. which i the think problem, is where you're seeing your friction yeah and thinking about it from an agency standpoint of where i'm sitting too what, what you're suggesting there is i got to make a preference between one or the other right that, and that's you know that's just so, a so, place. well no so, no, no. So just, i mean just like the one that exists between archery and rifle it's the same thing yeah, but now you're going with an archery equipment, which number one, there's a there's a law, a uh, a statute issue. Whereas I can't separate crossbows from vertical bows. Legislative, all archery legislatively, law. talk to me about so that. I, what is this? Well, that's yeah. where these laws. So there's only so many. That's a bullshit law. If there's that's only the case. so much. That's, stuff they're that saying crossbows are bows are legally yeah. defined archery as, tackle. As there's archery your problem. Tackle. <laughs> but that's at a legislative <laughs> level. So that's the thing is Brian and the board can make decisions on so much with the biologist recommendations. There's certain things, including Sunday hunting. The reason wow. Sunday hunting is not You're there, saying because of that piece of legislation, you guys literally would would not legally be able to say crossbow season should, should be different. I couldn't do it. Yeah, I couldn't do it. Yep. Yeah. Amazing. Well, it's just like when, you know, people will say, well, like, I wish the that's game, bullshit. Dude. I wish the game commission would make Sunday hunting legal. It's like, dude, they support it. They can't do it because it's at the sure. legislation level. A hundred percent. Well, that's why I stated everything. We're not blaming you, Brian. We're just trying to figure it out. That's crazy. Yeah, everybody else know. does. Come on. <laughs> that, that's like, we got to be on the other team here. Yeah. But that's, there you go. Cause it's, it's a statute. Amazing.